an abandoned school with a spooky past that we are going to unravel as we explore. Alright, so we're on a street. I don't see a school. Oh, look, vending machines. Usually, you can get something from these in these type of games. Destination is not this way. Um, but it's highlighted as if this is important. But I guess they were just kidding. Go back this way, no problem. Okay, I have an inventory and I already figured out run. We're doing that now. I am on my way to my father's alma mater, which is now in ruins. My father on his deathbed told me to stay away from his alma mater and breathe his last. However, whether it is because she wants some reason to understand her father's sudden death or simply out of curiosity, she has broken her father's promise and is now on her way to her alma mater. Not wanting to be reported as a suspicious person wandering around the school, I decided to search after the crowd had thinned out. After all, it is just a search for abandoned buildings. There would be no danger if I snuck in alone in the middle of the night. Even if there was, I would encounter vagrants at most. It must be so? I don't know. That's a little awkward, but... So I'm a girl whose dad told me not to come here for some reason. And I'm coming anyway. School closure notice. Uh... It's a notice of school closure. It has the date and time of the orientation, the date and the time are grazed and unreadable. It is probably written at the destination school, which is my father's alma mater. Okay, cool. Anything else here? I don't know, it's just, what is that? Anyways, we'll move on. Is that a school? This is a windowless building that looks like it's just a giant cube. Also, there are stars in the sky. Yippee. Usually it's just black. And they don't put any effort into there being a sky, but this time they did. Oh, also, I think I just saw a flashlight. There we go, perfect. All right, let's see. Um, it is a no entry sign. Entry is forbidden to all but those involved. However, there are probably no school officials left. And it just opened. Neat. All right, let's close that. Be safe. Right. That almost sounds like it locks. And it did. Okay. Hmm. This is a pretty big area. Uh, that can't be the school, right? That's too small. Okay, we got some trees over here. Some sports stuff. A playground consisting of a single slide. Alright, and then... Alright, there's a lot. So we're just gonna take it step by step. But let's explore the first building right in front of our face. It's unfortunate that there is no music in this game. It is pretty quiet except for my extremely loud footsteppings and also the sounds of this light. Oh wait, what is that? Save? Oh, we can save! Nice. I'm actually a little surprised to see a save location for starters. Oh. Okay. Maybe a ghost? As I was saying though, <clears throat> I'm surprised to see that for two reasons. For one, I've been playing for like a minute, why do I need a save already? And two, I actually was under the impression this game was a fairly short game. Like potentially just like 30 minutes or an hour. So do you really need to save? But perhaps it's longer than I thought, who knows. Uh, and the ghost thing went this way, so that's where we will go. Not open. Oh. Wait a minute. You left the ball out. You should clean up after you play with it. Put the ball back in the basket in the shed. Don't forget. Put the ball back in the basket in the shed. Once you're done cleaning up, come to me. You know where the janitor's office is, don't you? Okay. I'll be waiting for you then. Also, I can't move right now. Ah, right, there we go. Alright, so I think he said I- did, did I write that down? I didn't. Okay, a ball back- oh, 
Oh, the camera just pans immediately over here and there's a ball. The game's helping me out. That's good. Alright, so I put this in the shed, I think is what I saw. Oh, whoops. My bad. How right, must blah blah blah. How do I pick this up? Oh, there we go. I figured it out. Find the ball. I did. Okay, this is this a shed? I mean, no. Would this be a best shed? I mean, does this count? Honestly, I don't know if that counts. Oh, I'm assuming it probably counts if that's going off suddenly. All right, now I have to find a janitor closet or janitor office. I forget what he said. Oh wait, this is open now. This wasn't open before, right? Huh. Okay. Interesting. So... Oh, oh, okay. Now we can probably enter the school. Use the open school building entrance door. Normally this is not a place you're allowed to enter, but now my feelings prevail. Um... Oh, can we climb this? Okay, sure. I don't know why we have to go up here, but let's see. Nothing, nothing up here. I, oh, I can't get off the ladder. Oh, what's this? Oh, rusty knife. A knife with a rusted blade. It may have been used to open a cardboard box, but for- I guess we just had to see that bit of evidence or something? Alright, so I think we can just enter the school- oh. Janitor, I'm sorry for taking liberty. I will borrow some. Borrow some what? Interesting. Alright, school is this way. Okay, here we go. Mm -hmm. Let's open both those. Alright, got some cubbies. We gotta look in them. It's looking over here. Nothing. Good. Is there a light switch in here or- oh is this- yes. Oh how convenient. I totally thought I was gonna be in the dark this whole game. But these lights might actually stay on? Which if that's the case why do I need the flashlight? Well I guess we're under here is why I need it. Crouch. Do I need a crouch? Alright let's see. What do we got back here? Nothing. Alright what's this? Thank you. Oh, okay, that's what they meant to crouch for. Okay, so that's how I can get in there, despite the door being locked. Alright. Oh, oh, what the hell's going on over there? Some sort of distortion. Alright, let me- oh. Everything's kind of turning blue. Uh, oh, there's a ghost thing here? What are you hiding for? Come out. I can't go in it, but I'm actually kind of happy I can't go in because that means this is not going to be a survival horror that I have to worry about dying potentially. Well, I mean, I might die, but I don't have to worry about running around a lot, I assume. Alright, so we saw that. Uh, anything else in here? Not that I can see. I'll check the desks and whatnot. There's a flower here, which I feel like should be dead, and it is not. Um, looks like we're all set in here. Light switch. Oh, I didn't even see this. There, that's better. Now I can see better. Alright, yeah, I don't see anything. I don't think there's nothing in the cubbies. No, nope. I'm looking this one. No, no. Alright, let's get out of here, I guess. Oh, what does it say? Why? Interesting. Mm hmm. Okay, I guess we'll just go back this. Oh. Wait, wait. But then, is the, did I miss something in here? Is that why I can't exit? I mean, what did I miss? Oh, let me check the desk more. The front desk. Oh, there's actually a little cubby down here, but there's nothing in there. <sighs> Anything outside? I can't look out there. Oh, did that just open? Oh, can I jump out here? Huh. Oh, maybe here is a table to jump, maybe? Oh, okay. Am I supposed to jump out though? Because like, why would I get the key to enter the building and then I'm- oh. 
And then immediately leave the building, you know? That seems strange. I feel like I'm not done in there. Let's see if the front's suddenly locked or not. Um, no, it's, it's all good. Uh, that was interesting. Alright, what's this? Locked. What does it say? Staff room sign. It was a sign with the rules for when one had business in the staff room. The staff member is no longer there. I don't think I need to follow this rule. Okay, staff room. Locked. Probably need a key for that. And there's an upstairs, but I'm gonna hold off on going there until I have explored up here. What's this? Library sign. It's a sign in the library. It says to use the library quietly, but not only the library, but the entire school building is quiet. Alright, locked as well. Let me check under here. Oh. Have you been having a lot of odd self-study sessions lately? Well, that's fine, because I can skip it that way. What does that mean? I heard the teaching to the death. Really? That's why you've been so busy? Ah, oh, but I certainly haven't seen that lately. That was a weird combo. I, I did not follow at all what they were talking about. It seems like the translations aren't 10-10 in this game. But we'll, we'll figure it out, what they're trying to tell me, I'm sure, eventually. Alright, is this suspicious hallway dead end for- oh, here we go. Hello. No, please don't anymore. Don't kill me. Okay. Okay. I won't. Hmm. Anyway. Oh! Oh, what is that? Oh, oh, there is a ghost that is running around with, I think, a knife. And I'm dying. I'm dying for some reason. Okay. That was weird. Right, is it safe? Is she gonna be roaming around the whole game now? Okay, I don't see her. That was very strange. Okay, what we got here? Is that a gym? It looks like it's kind of a gym. Let's get this light switch on. Also, yes, I see that ghost. Alright, one second. Before I go to him, let me just see if maybe these lockers I hide in now. Um, no, I can't, I can't get in these lockers either. Okay, so maybe she isn't going to be chasing me. Perhaps she's just something I have to lightly avoid. Oh, I can't climb this ladder. Hello. He's being a pain in the ass. It's a long story. Um, okay. Oh, I think I kind of see a ghost person there. Yeah. But when I get closer, they disappear, which is strange as well. Everything in this game is just strange, I guess. Speech manuscript. I just feel like I'm kind of short. It's a manuscript paper with the speech content written on it. Apparently, there was a student hiding in the back of the school building smoking cigarettes. He preached at length about the fact that it was against the law and that it was harmful to his health. It is not hard to imagine that the majority of the students would not have listened makes sense. Staff room key. Okay, that was easy. We found it. This key can be used to open the door to the staff room. When I was a student, it took some courage to ask for the staff room in an abandoned school. I can ransack it without any resistance. Oh, oh did one of the lights fall? And it, like, fell right where that ghost boy was. Interesting. Alright, it looks like there's absolutely nothing else in this giant gym. Well, it's not that big of a gym, but, eh. Okay, so we can just go straight to the staff room, and then after the staff room we'll go upstairs, I guess? I think this is the library. Alright, staff room should be right here. Nice. Let's turn on the lights somewhere. There we go. Um, oh, is that another safe spot already? Cool. I'll take it, I guess. Save complete. So easy, so quick. Oh, lighter. And... It is in good condition, still has fuel in it, and can be lit. It can be used as a light, but a flashlight will suffice. Um, anything in here? No. Not sure what we do with this lighter. But, you know, it's good to have it for when we do need it. Alright, I think that's all there is in here. I assume I can't use this. Nope. Alright, so now I... Yeah, let's explore upstairs. Alright, let's see. Gotta get the lights on. I'm like really surprised the lights are staying on. 
I like it's so comforting. Alright, so let's go this way since you know we're closer to the side already. Alright, I don't know what room this is. And so far I cannot enter it. Oh, a ghost person. Okay. Ouch, the orange maybe bad ghost. And she disappears as I get closer. Alright, well she's just gone now. Interesting. Oh, is that more writing on the wall? Why is what it says again. Okay. Uh, maybe we need an item to interact with her? Or she's just there for decoration purposes? I'm not sure. Uh, not open. Okay. And... Alright, what about this? Oh, this opens. Okay. Music room sign. It's a sign in the music room. It says that what time students can use the room. It seems that they could use it freely until not too late, unless it's late, like right now. Okay. Well, let's check out the music room. It's the only room that we don't need a key for up here. Can we turn on the light? Where is it? Okay, we can't turn on the light here. Okay, we got a bunch of desks. We're gonna look at them. We're scanning. We're checking inside and on top. Inside and on top. Yep. All clear. No items. Okay, nothing. Let's crouch. Nothing. Oh, piano. Nice. Oh. Hmm. I actually was super sure we were gonna use this. That's okay, I guess. But then... What is the point of this room? I guess that's why it was just already unlocked. It wasn't important. I don't know. Maybe we come back. But then... I've explored every room I can. So... Um, I guess let's explore the grounds, because there is a lot to explore. Not just the school, there's like a whole bunch of areas out there. And another building, I think, nearby. Yeah, like this building over here. Perhaps there's a key in there for one of the- I think there's like four locked doors now in there or something. Maybe more. Oh, it opens. Okay, perfect. I thought it was locked for a second. Uh. Oh. Ha ha. What are you spraying water on? There's someone in there. Ha ha ha. But hey, I knocked. No one answered to no one's home. Ha 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 ha. Very funny, haha. <laughs> Alright, cool, 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 cool. Nothing over here. Alright, let me check over here. Neat. Not open. Nothing here. Not open. I expect there's something here. And there's not. Interesting. Oh, sh what am I supposed to do about this? I can move. Trick. Let me in. <laughs> a bucket, a bucket for cleaning, a thing that draws water. That doesn't do anything. Ghost corruption is dangerous. Bro, bro, what the fuck? Oh god, oh jeez Louise. Let me get lighter up. Does lighter do anything? Oh darn, I just died, didn't I? Uh, it's just, it looked like at the last second there the door finally opened. The bathroom door that I was trying to get into to escape her. But I wasn't in a position to enter it in time, and I couldn't see either because my flashlight was going wonky. Fuck me. Okay. We just- oh crap, my screen. Okay. Screen lagged out for a second there, that was unfortunate for me. I'm just gonna spam the sword. I'm gonna stand right here and just wait for it. Please, please open, please open, please open, please open, please open, please open, please open. Please open. Please open. Oh, thank god, thank god. Close, close, close. Phew. Is there anything in here? There's a- Alright, hopefully she is just gonna pass and disappear like last time. Oh, that's scary. Also, there's writing here. It just says why again. Interesting. Is there really nothing in here though? Like. Hmm. Alright, let's see. A bucket for cleaning, a thing that draws water. You can use the water, wash mops and rags, we pour water over the door. 
I mean, this sounds like something I should be using, but it's it's not letting me pick it up, bad to inventory or anything. So I'm not really sure why that is there. Oh, this opens now. Okay. Maybe there's something in here. Oh. 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 I don't know, some sort of graphical issue or something. That was wild. But no, it doesn't seem like anything's in here either. Uh, the store is- was this store closed before? And there doesn't seem to be anything in here either. I guess this building was just to scare me? Or maybe like eventually I can come back for the bucket? I, I have no idea what I need that bucket for right now though. Alright, I'm out. We're never going back in there again. I'm s well, I would need the bucket to use this, right? That would make sense. Alright, anyways, I wanted to check out... I don't know. Look around the grounds. Mm. Those are like the flowers that I saw in that room. It's the gym. And then there's this area that looks like it leads to like off into the distance onto a different street, but I assume I'm not supposed to go that way. Probably an invisible wall or something, so I'll just uh, keep looking. Is that something? No. Could be something back here. Oh, is that a note? Perfect. Let's see. Cigarette prohibition sign. It is a sign condemning underage smoking. Apparently some students were smoking cigarettes behind their backs. It is doubtful if the sign has any effect. Okay. Oh, cigarette. Okay. Wait, what? What am I- I'm just smoking now? You, you're the one who tipped off teacher. I didn't do that. Shut up. You guys hold that guy down. Interesting. From today on, you're an ashtray. Prepare yourself. Mm hmm. Okay, some bullying going on. Obviously, we've seen that already. Oh, wait a second. This doesn't seem right. What the? Why? Why is it suddenly the street and not the rest of the school? This, okay. Cool. I guess we're done with the school. Perfect. Why am I only myself? Also, let's see if these running machines work. They don't. Sounds like ghost stuff is going on. Oh, wait a second. Ghosts. Wait, but I can't, can't interact with it? What am I supposed to do then? stare at her? I guess we'll just ignore that and keep going. Oh. Okay, now I'm back to where I should be. Oh, so it says something here now. Unforgivable. That's something different. Oh, also, is that the piano in the music room playing right now? I assume that's probably where it wants me to go next, then. Alright, I will go check that out. Yeah, it sounds very loud right here, and I think the piano room's up there. Music room in general. Alright, so we can go up these stairs and be right there, I think. flowers there before? Hello? Can you play the organ? I can't. Not at all, but doing this helps me forget about things I don't like. Do you have something like that, Taru? Mm, I can't see her anymore. I'm reading books in the library or something like that. Alright. Let me 
makes it sound like we should be going to the library next. But I don't think I can unlock the library unless it's just unlocked now for a reason. Would they have been placed at from the beginning? Question mark. I don't know if it's suggesting I should go to where I saw flowers or... Hmm. Alright, um, library. Is the library up here or is it downstairs? I don't remember. It doesn't say if that's the library or not. I'll just, uh, wait, let me try this again. Alright, so I think I'm gonna try just real quick with the flower thing. It, it could have just been awkward broken English that didn't really mean what I think, but... I'm just gonna check real quick if we're around here, if there's anything. No. Hmm. I mean, I like already explored everything in the school, so I feel like I have to start roaming out here. Second, it's just I thought. Hey, I kind of hear ghost noises right now. Oh, blue screen. Oh, who's this? I can't find my keys. I think I dropped it while playing with a student. Oh, okay. Perfect. Maybe that's the key I need or a key to a different room. But that's still something. Alright. I guess it's just the one thing to play with here besides the ball. Okay, yeah, here we go. Broadcast room. It's not the library, but I'll take it. Um, I already looked back here, right? Let me just... There is a random circle of them here, which does seem a little suspicious. Perhaps this is where the student hung themselves. Alright, anyways, I'm gonna go to the broadcast room. Do I even know which room is the broadcast room? I don't know if I recall seeing a sign for that. I must have. Alright, well, we're going there. Dun 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 dun. Okay, so would it be on this floor or upstairs? Library. Okay. Um. That's staff room. Blah blah blah. Okay, so it has to be upstairs. Maybe this is the broadcast room. No. Mm, this one. No. Well, wasn't the one over here the music room? God damn it! All right. Uh, broadcast. God damn. I don't know where the broadcast room is. Confused. Uh, um, I mean, I tried every door, so like, oh, wait, what's this? I guess this maybe is the broadcast room. I don't know. Manuscript paper for school broadcasts. Is a manuscript paper with the content of the school broadcast. It is a warning students not to climb the school building. It seems that many students climb up the school building as a test of courage. It seems that many students climb up the gutters and downsprouts to test their courage. Even though they are told not to do it, they still want to do it. Whoa. And nothing in there. Anything over here? No. Anything on this thing? No. Can I open the windows? There's nothing out there. Wait, what's this? Watch out, Hanuko. Wasn't that outside and we're on the second floor? Or are we on the f I don't remember. Oh wait, there she goes. Get down here before you get hurt. Can I go out there? I, I don't see anything out there. That's weird. Oh, a phone. Is there a phone in here? Okay, one second. Let me just finish checking the shelves. The phone's gonna have to wait. I'm looking. I'm busy. It needs to be respectful. Okay, uh, it's not a phone. I think the staff room, there was a phone. I'm just gonna go check there. Or maybe it was upstairs after all, I don't know. But I'm already running this way, so we'll just check real quick. Alright, is this it? Yep. Oh, okay, just- well, there's a note here now that I don't think was there before. Memo on answering the phone. A note has been scribbled. It was probably written while answering the phone. The name of the caller, the murder that occurred on campus, the school's inadequate response, an apology, a jump, suicide, other student care, the gloomy teal kills are written all over the place. A student named Hanako seems to be the person in the middle of it all. Seems to have killed or injured a number of students and then took her own life. And I don't know why that is. 
I know that there was a boy getting bullied, we saw that. So I'm not really sure why Hanako now is going on a rampage. But perhaps she knew the boy that got bullied and it was revenge of some sort, I don't know. Okay, so what do I do now? I know I need to go to the library? Is, what does this say? I've seen the memories of the ghost many times, I don't feel very good, but I feel no sign of getting out of here, so I have no choice but to continue my search. Hmm. Library. Oh, I will, one second. It's just I saw people running around behind the building, right? Or, I don't know. I think it said something about the kids climbing gutters? Maybe I'm supposed to climb gutters? I don't know. I don't like see any. Like, there's a gutter here that's on the ground. That's not helpful. Is this? Nope, that's not a gutter either. There's none over here. Not this. Well, there's a gutter up there, but that's all. Oh, here's this one. Can I climb this one? Oh, it looks like I can. Oh, this is awkward. Oh. Oh. Okay, we're going up. Seems dangerous. That's why they don't want the students doing this. Alright, we're on the building. Okay, I don't see anything here. Oh wait, what's that? Oh, it's a person. Uh, uh there's no way I'm jump. Like I don't jump that high. I don't. I don't think I'm, I make that. There's no way. All right. I think. Do I? Am I? But I even survive jumping here. I guess we're just gonna test it. Oh, okay. We survived. Nice. Let me see if I can climb up here. I don't think so, but you know. Oh, okay, probably run onto that. That makes sense. We did it. Alright, um, then maybe we can get into a classroom from here or something? I don't know. I can't even see inside there right now. It's, okay, whatever. Oh, there's a hole in the floor here. doesn't seem like I can enter this room this way, which is super silly because I definitely can just go through that window, but the game does not want that. It's fine. Oh wait. Okay, we could probably maybe go the rest of the way up from here? It looks that way. Okay, perfect. And then we can probably reach the person, so it seems like I wasn't meant to try to jump the distance. So I was starting to wonder if I should have tried, after all. Uh, they were over here? Yeah, I think I see them, maybe. Oh, oh. Wait, library key. Oh, we did it. It took a while, but we figured it out. Good for us. This should be safe to jump, right? Oh, no. No. Man, do I have to do the whole process of getting on the roof again? How unfortunate. That didn't- like, that wasn't higher than what I had jumped down from before, right? From that taller roof to that shorter roof? That's like the same- oh good, I'm still on the roof, thank goodness. And I still have the key. Alright, so we're gonna go back the way we came. Be safe about- oh. Oh, what the hell? It's just- why is it suddenly super dark? What the- I like, can't see anything. Let me take out the lighter. That's not really helping too much. Let me try the flashlight again. Alright. I think it's probably this. Okay, back down it. Yeah, there we go. Alright. I wonder if it'll let me jump from here to there? That should be a safe distance. Oh, fuck. Okay, I did that by accident. I didn't mean to jump down there, but it luckily it worked out. Alright, the library is on the first floor, I think. 
and might be the last room on the first floor to unlock, I think. Also, while we're here, I might as well save. Save. Neat. Like, I love how easy it is. You just click and immediately go. Alright, this is the library? Yes. Unlock. Thank you. I'm gonna get in here and... Light switch. Perfect. Oh, okay, this is the room where there's a hole at the top. But I don't really need that hole to get into this room since I'm already in this room, so I don't know why the hole's there. Hmm. So far, I don't see anything in particular. Oh, okay, cool. Oh, I don't know what I'm looking at. Hey, if you want, why don't you try an exchange diary? It's fine, but if there's a baggage check, the teacher will get mad at me. I'm not sure why. Then let's just hide it somewhere on... Students don't use often the library, therefore on top of the bookshelf. Convenient for me. Okay, but are you sure if you get involved with me, blah blah blah? Hmm. Okay, so they said a diary is on top of a bookshelf. I don't see one here. Oh, it doesn't look like there's one over here. I don't really see one over here unless, damn it. Is that why there's a hole in the floor? Oh wait, one second. Ugh, game lagged for a second. That was annoying. Alright, anyways. Flowers, would they have been placed at from the beginning? Anyway. Oh, I wonder if that's giving- because when I last went to look for a bunch of flowers, it did kind of sort of lead me to the next key when I went out and explored a little bit around the flowers I came across that ghost teacher who lost her keys so maybe that other circle of flowers that I saw by that tree will have something but I don't know but I don't know if I can just yeah I'm pretty sure you're meant to jump down this hole and then the diary is probably in that box let me see if I can get on this table I mean I can't see a diary from here but there isn't a diary on top of that and I checked the other shelves all along there. And I can't- I don't think I can move any of this furniture around. So no, I don't think I can get up there. Um... Yeah, no. But that's a room that's locked though, so... I need to find a key for that. Um, Alright. Uh, since, like I said, I feel like that flower in that room was a sign to go find another patch of flowers somewhere. And let me just relook at this patch of flowers real quick while I'm here. Alright, so I'll go to the only other patch of flowers that I know of currently, which is by the tree back there. Let me see if there happen to be any other ones around. Um, I don't think so. Okay, so far there is nothing here. Oh, it's super duper faint. Like, you probably wouldn't be able to hear it if you don't have headphones on and the volume super loud. But I can kind of swear to hear something glitchy. But it's very far from the distance, so I don't think it's near this flower patch. Actually, it sounds, it comes, it sounds like it's coming from down here. Alright, let me see if I can go down here. Oh, I can. Okay. I thought this was going to be a uh, invisible wall situation. Okay, that sounds very spooky. Oh. 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 Okay, it just brought me back here, so that didn't help. So it was kind of pretty much like as if there was an invisible wall. Alright, so I don't know where there's any other bunches of these flowers, and I still haven't found anything to try to use with the bucket so and i've looked all around the back side of the school 
I've tried to get into that one room that I- or I think it's one of two rooms that I have locked left and I can't get in through it through the windows on the outside or cubbies. I don't know if there's any other patches of flowers I forgot about. Pretty sure there's nothing I have to do with this ball, but I'll keep it in mind, I suppose. Okay, let's see. Pretty sure there shouldn't be anything new in here. Are there patches of flowers over here, perhaps? I think they're specifically dandelions. I don't know. I was already in the bathroom, and I didn't get anything in the bathroom, even though it totally seems like you're supposed to get something there. I mean, I'll check again, but... Move that out of the way. Alright, there's nothing I can do with this. I already saw that. It doesn't seem like there's anything in there. And if there is, I probably am supposed to use the button. I mean, bucket for that. But it won't let me. So, you know. Let me just... Oh, okay. Maybe on the outside of the building I can put a... Yeah, I don't think so. I've explored the entirety of the grounds, I feel like. Um, 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 um. Well, I could try to interact with her ghost again. That was in, like, that final hallway area on the second floor, and she was just standing there for seemingly no reason. But, I don't know, I don't have anything new to do her, so... We'll see. Do I have anything on me? I don't. Yeah, all the rooms down here are all done for. I just need to get into... is it this room? Yeah, this is the room with the hole. But it won't let me in. And I already tried to get in through the windows. And I don't think I can get in through this room, right? Like, I can't bash through the wall or anything. Maybe, yeah, maybe if I knock on it, I didn't realize you could even knock, really. Open. I knocked politely. Alright, let's see. Anything new with you? I mean, it seems like- I don't know if by imagination, but it looks like there's more writing on the walls now. Let's see, what does it say? No. Why? Unforgivable. Why again? Uh, kill. And... What does this say? I don't know. I can't seem to line my flashlight with it. I don't know. I guess we're not done. I imagine that- oh, there's this here too. That this whole wall is gonna be filled with words and maybe a coherent sentence will be formed. But yeah, that's the last room left. And I don't have any sort of key for it- oh sh- That scared me, oh my goodness. Oh, you didn't play with him today? No, I just played with him. He had- what? Some kind of letter. What is that? A love letter, perhaps? I don't know. I ripped it to shreds. Whoa, poor thing. <laughs> he was crying and collecting scraps. Letter. I laughed at that. Um. Memory updated. Okay. From a corner of the school building, I sent something. Oh, okay. So maybe now? Oh yeah, there's more letters there suddenly. A lot more. Okay, yeah, I think it's time to talk to her. Oh wow, there are a shit ton of letters now. Kill, 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 bunch of kill, kill. 
Oh, okay. She's not here anymore. If I'm a little nervous, I might die, TBH. Alright, let's see what this says. A piece of paper with red text, and for some reason a little bit is cut out there at the end. Written in what looks like blood, the main bully, the crony, the student who did not stop, the student who continued to stand by, the teacher who turned a blind eye, the principal who tried to cover it up. I will not forgive them all. I will kill them. I will kill every single one of them. I will kill myself for failing to stop them. I will not forgive anyone who was involved. I will kill them. I will not forgive them. Even if I fail to kill them, I will curse them to death. I will kill, 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 kill. The vindictive words are written in a series of scrawls. Upon closer inspection, a list of names could be seen beneath the blood letters. Among them were the name of my father and grandpa. Oh no. This isn't a good place for me. Oh no, the lights are off. This is unfortunate. Oh no. Oh, I'm in danger now. Oh. Oh, oh, gross. Ooh, she made a real splooshy noise. I guess we're supposed to go outside and check on her? I just want to walk slow and steady. I'm very nervous. Oh, also, I never was able to get into this final room. One second, let me back up real quick. Well, maybe she has the key to this room. Or maybe body. I'm a little nervous about running right now. Isn't there supposed to be stairs nearby? What the? The stairs disappeared. It's kind of cool, TBH. Oh, I unlocked. Wait, wasn't this already unlocked? I already came in here. This is a broadcasting room. Anyway. Oh, the light switch is in here working. I don't suppose I can just turn the lights back on in this hallway? Oh god, this hallway is really long, huh? Yep, I just, I just realized. Fuck. Music room. Yeah, this is not where the music room is supposed to be. Alright, I'll just jog and we'll see what happens. Looks like we are probably nearing the end of this game. Let's see what this says. Unforgivable. They finally decide to add music to this game. Kill. Why? Lie. Unforgivable. Unforgivable. I probably don't have to stop to look at all these, sorry. Oh, hello. I don't know what's going on here. I guess we'll just keep moving. I haven't seen that guy lately. Did he- did him change schools or dead like I thought? this matter hidden. Do not answer any questions either to the students or to the press. Assume that's it for that exchange. Now we jog a bit more. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no no no. no, no. I have a My flashlight's supposed to work in the dark. Oh goodness. Alright. Oh no. It's, it's so dark. Oh man. Right, I'm gonna st I'm gonna stay against the wall. I think that's a good plan. All right, maybe this is the final room I needed unlocked. Principal's room key. Oh, oh, I am in the principal's room key. I mean, room. The lights aren't working. Oh wait, the lights kind of working. Okay, obviously I think we're supposed to just jump down, but okay, here, let's look at this. Notification to staff. This is a form written by the principal to the staff. It is about our student, Taru, who committed suicide by hanging in the schoolyard. We expect that the press will come to our school. They will ask you if you are aware of the abuse, but do not answer any of their questions. Likewise, do not tell the students what happened. 
There is a possibility that students will leak information. When returning home, use the back entrance as much as possible. It should be less conspicuous than going out the main gate. We have placed traffic cones to prohibit the passage of students, but this will only serve as a comforting reminder. The principal's name is written at the end of the sentence. It is the same name, oh no, as my grandfather's. I was wondering how both her grandfather and dad could be involved with this. Like, they couldn't have both been bullies in the same school at the same time, but now this explains it. Alright. Oh, crap. Okay. I said, oh, crap, because my screen lagged again. I don't know if you see that with the recording, but anyways. Now we hop down. Yeah, I can see the diary. Alright. Oh, boy. Exchange diary. A diary to be filled in by more than one person. It was a popular among students at the time. What is written in the diary are everyday contents. This diary seems to have been exchanged between a student named Taro and a student named Hanako. The last page of the diary reads, I'll be waiting for you in the music room after school. Uh, a student committed suicide by hanging in the schoolyard. However, it seems that the teachers who wanted to evade responsibility tried to cover it up. If we look into this matter in detail, Bill would be able to find a way out of this place or a way to appease the grudge. Can I... Alright, it looks like... Okay. So does that mean I have to go to the music room right now? Is that the play right here? Because I've already been there twice. I, I don't know... That going again is, like, awesome. But I guess... Sure. Is it on this floor? I c God damn, I can remember. Okay, I think it's upstairs. Also, can we get these lights back on? Thank you. Alright, it should be down here. Ooh, ooh, I'm spooked. I'm spooked already. Hello, I was told to come to the music room. Hmm. Maybe not. Oh wait, uh, this is more flowers, I think. I don't know, I feel like it looks bigger than before. Perhaps I'm mistaken. Um, right now it doesn't seem like there's anything going on in the music room. So I think what I'm gonna do now that it's been confirmed that the student hung themselves in the courtyard and there's that one tree with the suspicious circle of these flowers, I'm gonna go check that location is what I'm thinking. I don't see why they would want me to come to the music room. Thought I saw something there, but I think I imagined it. Alright, let's uh, go to the location where it all began. Also, what was that? Let me go back real quick. It kind of looked like some sort of interact button was there, but perhaps I think it was just for the lights. Alright, my bad. Let's continue um, this way. There it is. I don't see anything so far. Oh, I hear something. Oh no! Why would he do that with his backpack still on? Envelope with scraps of paper. An envelope with finely torn pieces of paper stuck inside. The scraps of paper appear to have had something written on them. It was probably originally letterhead on the envelope is written to Hanako. Memory updated. A letter that must have been written to someone important. It was torn shreds and in a dismal state, but still there might be someone who needs this letter. They must have been waiting for it for a long time. Alright, so now I'll try the music room, since he said for her to wait there. And then, if she's not in the music room, I will check that corner that she was in for a while before that. And if she is not there, then I think I will check the library. And then if she's not there, then I'll just check the grounds as a whole. Oh, yep, here we go. Please be cool. Please be cool. Be cool, please. Be cool, please. Be cool. How do I give her this letter if she's trying to kill me? 
I mean, they just have to be brave. Here, take, take the fucking letter. I handed her an envelope containing a scrap paper. Yeah? Oh. Did I click her? She's thinking. She's, she's, she's thinking about the letter. Oh, I'm not sure what I do now. Do I- maybe now I can leave the school? And leave, uh, through that, uh, street area I wasn't able to before? Um... Alright, I think I'll try to go. Uh, you have a nice time with that letter. Oh, I won't allow it. Me or her? What is she not gonna allow? But... Interesting. Long pause. Oh, I think that's the end of the game. After that, I found myself on my way home. How nice. I didn't get killed. We were able to leave without incident. This is like a surprisingly good happy ending. My grandfather died before I was born, so I didn't know him. It seems he was the principal of this school. Perhaps because of his attempt to cover up Taro's case, his grandfather was cursed to death by Hanako. My father seemed to have been in school at the same time as Taro and Hanako. Okay. I don't know if my father was involved in the abuse, but he was probably cursed to death as a person involved. Mm -hmm. As his father's son, I can say that I am related to him. I won't allow it, although at the end of the day I felt like that's what they told me to do. I am still alive. Great. We did it. But why all these dots? In that abandoned school, I felt the resentment that she still remained across generations. Whenever possible, live your life without doing anything that would cause resentment. Yes, I think so. Okay, I think that was it. That wasn't a bad game. I mean... This game was practically free, it cost less than a dollar, so I would say that was totally worth it. Obviously it had some issues, especially with translations, but I had fun, I hope you did too, and thanks for watching.